Hello. It's been a minute. Welcome to me. I am making this video because it's been a long time and I wanted to give some updates about my life <laughs> and my chest. Um, I am, oh, I made a list of things to talk about so I would remember. Um, I am two and a half years post-op. I am three years and 10 months on T. I am a junior in college. I just turned 21. I have face hair now. Just a tiny bit here and a lot here. Um, I I'm a 12 year old when it comes to how much I love my face hair, meaning I refuse to shave and I love and talk about it all the time still. Like nothing's changed from like day one to now. I still spend a lot of time talking about my chin hair. Um, other things not related to being trans are I am a uh, resident assistant, an RA uh, at college. And this is my second year doing that. Um, well, the first year is fun. This year is really hard because burnout. Uh, let's see, what else, what else, what else? Um, I still work at camp. Um, okay, now let's get to the show. I'm going to show you guys my nipples. Okay, so here's my chest. I'm just gonna move this down here just a smidge so y'all can all see it. Oh, well, not, well, let's take more time getting the angle. Oh, well, fuck me. Okay, sorry about the cursing. Okay, here is my chest. Can you see it okay? So, this is what it looks like two and a half years. The scars go all the way up here. The drain hole is in my armpit somewhere, completely gone. No scar whatsoever. Um, these are where the scars go from like far away. You can, well, if the lighting was good, you could still not tell that there were scars, which is really nice. Um, the last video I made about my chest, I was saying I might get a revision here. I decided not to because I didn't want the scar to go like up like this. I still don't like how there's tags here, but it's whatever. Um, I got it Dr. Stanwyck, sorry to say that, I, it happened in 2017. And this is the scar care I'm using right now. <laughs> wow, makeup. Um, it's by a trans company, it's really cool, I really like the, it. Um, I still do scar care every day, either uh, once or twice a day, depending if I remember or not. Um, I just am obsessed with scar care, and every time some random trans person puts an ad on Instagram being like, I made a scar care, buy it. I buy it just because I'm obsessed with scar care. <sighs> I don't know, I just really want them to go away and they're pretty much gone, I just, whatever. Uh, what else should I talk about? What should I talk about? What should I talk about? What should I talk about? 